of the series of trying to fix my uh, touchscreen 3.5 from Banggood. Now I installed some software which I'll go through later on which will be number four of course but what happened was I installed the touch UI um, from github which worked fantastic and it's done a great job it works fine now you will have to attach a um, Bluetooth or a Logitech keyboard or some sort of keyboard to the system so you can log in I don't know why I've pressed log in automatically it won't do it so that's fine um, now you can see that everything is very well active now that I can get into things now originally it had a square box here and it had close at the bottom and I pressed close and it wouldn't close and it had all the updates you could get rid of all the latest updates that was fine but you couldn't get rid of the close box now to fix that right and you will get that um, if you've got ABBL um, expert or ABL installed in your plugins you need to go to the plugin manager go to your plugin manager don't use this because you won't be able to use this to get into it because it covers this whole area here and you won't be able to use it you go to your laptop and you grab your plugin manager and you disable the ABL I'm going to show it to you in a second so just hold on Okay, here I am on my normal standard screen, which hasn't turned into um, the touch UI yet, which it could at any minute. What I did was I ended up opening up here, which is the um, settings in Octal Print. I came down here originally and I found that I did have octal print plugin stuck in here and I disabled something on it but that didn't work so I went up and I went into plugin manager and on the first page of plugin manager was um, and originally well, let's go back to it ABL expert plugin you need to disable it and reboot the computer otherwise you'll have that um, box and in the box is writing but you can't see it because it's actually white and because it's white you can't read it and you can't close it so yeah now while I'm here I'm wondering I'll just pause so to get to this point after I inverted everything I went to this web address here which I'll try and put down the bottom of my thing and it actually explains to you in great detail um, to install this github clone and then install it and run the helper and it gives you all other information but right after you do that you'll end up with that if you've got the ABL act activated you'll end up with that up the top and you won't be able to do anything but other than that it's pretty well working now so I'm going to put up all three videos now and I hope it helps someone out um, if you've got any comments please leave them below I'll try to help out it was a full mammoth day trying to work out how to get this thing working I did look at another youtuber and they didn't explain it very well and it ended up being look follow what I say not what I do kind of thing but there was some stuff there that you had to work out yourself so I've worked it out my, myself in number two it shows you some of the things I did to make it work but now it works fine so all good okay I'll catch you on the next one and I hope you're all having a wonderful day or a wonderful night wherever you are and I'll catch you soon